What's Good. going on, everybody? Ryan and Sean, I guess Aaron is here too. It's a beautiful Saturday morning here at DVT, guys. We are restocking some stuff. We are. We have the what? orange beanie gang. Yeah, we, have, we both have orange beanies today. We have the power. Yes. But we're restocking this morning, guys. We're also looking to buy toys today. Today, not tomorrow. That's right, friends, because tomorrow, Scott and Sean are going to go somewhere on a little road trip to pick up some stuff. So while they're gone, we're only going to be doing trades tomorrow. We're going to be open from 11 to 6 like normal, but we're only doing trades. So if you want to sell toys, let's For do that cash today. money. Let's do that today. Or, or you can trade. trade too. Yeah, we're always down to trade, guys. We've got a lot of cool stuff to show you. So let's take a gander. Like I said, we're restocking the Legends right now, guys. We've got the Apocalypse Wave 2. The What If Wave, we've got tons of X-Men. I mean, all kinds of heavy hitters, guys. We're putting them all out. We're trying to do like one per character so you can have a whole bunch of variety. Working on that. Some schmo bought it, brought in all of this cool Ghostbuster stuff. I mean, we've got some unopened slime marshmallow guys. Yeah, I'm gonna eat that right now. It says, don't do that though, oh. you get real sick. <laughs> Oh. But they're blind bags, guys. So there's six different ones in here. Pretty cool. Speaking of six different ones, if you get another set, you can have six different mini marshmallow men from the Afterlife stuff. We're talking vintage here, vintage here, vintage here, reissue here, and then uh, Ultimate's Mumra from Super 7. So I have a question. Yo. If you eat this, uh -huh. is that where you have to go? 100% yes. And, and then know, your we, face is like that. We should we should make someone do that today. Mm. Be like, hey, who wants to eat this? <laughs> We're having fun, right? So, guys, we do have the Ghostbusters Afterlife figures in there as well. We've got the Phoebe set. We've got Old Man Ray, Old Man Peter, I believe, has sold. We do have the kids still. Those are all complete. We're trying to revamp this as well this morning, guys, to get it going. When are the new graded bits coming? Uh, uh, pretty soon, right? Shipping is kind of a nightmare right now across the board, whether you're in I the just toys, paper, everything. talked to them yeah. yesterday. Uh, we are getting billed invoices. They are eight weeks behind on just billing. Right. Um, they're going to try... Some of our stuff was sent in August, so... Hopefully soon. Uh, we got, I think, six or seven invoices. We have about 400 items being graded. Um, hopefully they'll start trickling in, I think, next month, unfortunately. But uh, we do have lots of good stuff being graded. And we are going to send some more stuff off to get graded. I can't wait to get back. Uh, we have, I forgot how much stuff we have there. But there's a uh, carded vintage uh, Star Wars, carded vintage G.I. Joe's, Jurassic Park, um, Dino Riders, uh, Indiana Jones, Star Wars. Uh, You're breaking the news, you know, like April. Lots of, uh, I mean, we have so much stuff there. So lots of good stuff. I can't wait for everything to come back. And that's and then on the that, website. And then that will revamp our graded room because y'all are buying tons of it. I can't wait for it to come back. So stay tuned to that. The second it comes in, I'm sure we're going to be doing videos and posts. Mm -hmm. um, everybody just keep in mind too, you know, Chinese New Year is happening in February. So on top of the delays, that is kind of a thing we're working through right now. Come early March though, we're going to be flooded with all of these awesome figures, guys. But until then, we have all of these other awesome figures to talk about. Like an American Werewolf in London. The Ultimate Wolf is still in stock, guys. Definitely want to check those out before Both? they're gone. Or is that three different gargoyles? Two different gargoyles. Okay. We've got the Goliath and the Thalog, which is Goliath backwards. It's just an evil version of Goliath, which is awesome, though. I can't yes, we it. were on three episodes of Pawn Stars. Both of mine aired in December. Scott's is going to air sometime soon. So. Hey, yeah. Guys, we've got world championship titles. Are you kidding? You know I'm about this. This is pretty sweet. So I challenge you to a match today. Whoever wants to come in and pick up this belt will have a battle royal. These Star Wars pieces are pretty cool. I noticed that this morning when I was cleaning some stuff up. You don't see those all the time. We still have some Simpsons stuff, guys. It has shrunk a bit, but my personal favorite are the Mondo 1-6 scale turtles. We still somehow have all four People can't look up like Shaun of the Dead. Dogs can't look up. Right? Yes, they can. Yes, they can. Guys, what's really cool about these is that they all come with the comic red bandanas as well. Holy glare, Batman. I got it. You got it? All right. But yeah, I mean, you can have them be the OG colors or the all red team, which is pretty cool. 
something you don't see too terribly often done right in Turtles. So that's an awesome piece. Oh, speaking of, we got the Haya Toys RoboCop Ed 209. This is a pretty cool piece. If you're looking for just a mini thing to put on your desk, got to show some RoboCop action, have them kill some predators. The Haya Toys stuff is actually pretty cool right now, guys. They're coming out with a lot of interesting stuff. So if you're interested in that, check that out. Plenty of Super 7 Ultimates, guys. TMNT, New Japan Pro Wrestling. We've got the Entertainment Earth exclusive glow-in-the-dark mutagen man. Don't buy that. That's too cool. That is pretty cool. I mean, this thing glows like crazy. The box does as well, which is pretty sweet. Tons of Castle Grayskulls, guys. Motu Origins is alive and well, and the Castle Grayskull is the centerpiece to all of the collections. I've seen people display this with the vintage as well, guys. Plenty of vintage modes. We have a loose one over there, too. We do have a loose one with the Wind Raider. Um, and we have the vintage one as well. Definitely check those out, guys. Plenty of uh, pre-owned figures as well as carded ones over here. We have the uh, Green Goddess, which is awesome. Gosh, I didn't even realize this. We've got the Beast Man uh, from Lords of Power. This is pretty cool. So, yeah, there's all kinds of awesome new stuff at the guys. There's a 200X one up there as well. And yeah, we've got some of the Kevin Smith line as well here. Ooh, check out this. Johnny Lawrence from NECA Toys. This is a cool one. Phantom. Guys, I mean, there's all kinds of awesome stuff we're putting out, trying to rearrange some stuff, getting it back, ready to party, if you will. Tons of Star Wars stuff, guys. I know we got some archive series in. These are pretty hard to find. <coughs> I mean, you know, Boba Fett is doing his thing right now. You're definitely going to need some more Sand Troopers. We I mean, have been selling a bunch of, uh, we little, 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 we've been selling a bunch of banthas. That is. This is kind of cool. There's a Brachiosaurus, a long neck. Range Trooper. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> got a Breaker. Breaker. Those, those just came in. That's pretty cool. Tons of Troopers, guys, to army build. Pretty usual. I mean, like, the Clone Wars stuff is awesome. The Camino Trooper. We've got the Elite Squad Trooper from Bad Batch as well. Tons of vintage collection stuff, guys. Or Black Series Junior, if it were, you know? They're pretty awesome. Tons of detail going to those. This exclusive two-pack is pretty awesome. I believe this was an Amazon exclusive originally, but it's got the Forlom and Zuckus cards like the vintage style. Tons of cool Marvel Legends, guys. Venom, this one is awesome. You'll see this all the time. And the What If Hydra Stomper. I've seen a lot of people army build these and put them with their G.I. Joes. Really hmm. looks cool. I think we just got this Hulk figure in, too. Oh, is that, that one the, right there? Oh, wow, yeah, this is the Hulk figure, guys. So we ordered a lot of these. This is cool. Someone wants to know if we have any Star Wars hot toys. Boy, do we. Guys, this is only $40. I'm breaking the fourth wall right now. Like, this is really hard to find. Definitely want to swing by. That's cool. Star Wars hot toys. Guys, we have some really cool ones. Check this out, okay? We got some masterpiece stuff. Oh, then we got some new, uh, new of those dudes. Figure arts, yeah. The Bardock. So I'm drawing a collection of those. And a Super Saiyan Super God Vegeta. This one's pretty cool. I like the Pac-Man figure arts quite a lot. Like for a figure arts, it's pretty cheap, all things considered, and you get a lot for it. Really a cool piece. My personal favorite, though, guys, if we're talking figure arts, monster arts. Godzilla, 1989 Godzilla vs. Biollante. And then the Gigan from Final War. Those are awesome. Oh, but real quick, we do have some Mafex. People are always asking, do you guys have Mafex? We have Hush. Hush, Ryan. They yeah. were asking about Star Wars. We'll get there, I promise. Oh, guys. how's the Star Trek stock? <laughs> we also got that. We'll go over this yeah, way. Tons of cool, I'm telling you guys, this is no hyperbole. We have That's new, the cool Masterpiece uh, Convoy. We've got the Masterpiece Beast Wars stuff, guys. We've got an OG Grimlock here. They're not asking for that, Ryan. I know. I'm just so excited. <laughs> so we got in lots of new Star Trek. This came in that... Uh, Spider-Man. Spider yeah, we have so much new stuff, so we probably just uh, put maybe well over 500 new items in the what store. What was the last time you guys saw these? I mean, be honest. It's been a these are like, Some of these came in factory cases, too, That's so really these cool. are case fresh. I mean, Hobgoblin, you know, like... And like I said, uh, they're all stocked up over here. Just uh, tons of KB Toy Store. 
This minty, is 90s glory. Minty fresh. We get asked all the time, do you guys have spawn? Usually we say no. Guys, take advantage of it when and you do, right? So a lot of this stuff is dirt cheap. Check out this violator. I mean, he's come a long way, you know? <laughs> That's and cool we have piece. some big ones somewhere okay. else. Uh, there's some more X-Men and stuff. Let's go over to the... Uh, Hot toys. Hot toys. So this Rancor up here. That is cool. Guys, you know, the HasLab one failed. So you've got money for a Rancor. Boom. Look at the sideshow. I mean, I'm just saying, it, it makes sense to me. You wanted one real bad. You saved for it. They couldn't come through. We can't. And we also have Layaway. And we're also buying toys today. Not tomorrow, but today. <laughs> and we're also trying. We would love to spend six figures on toys. And check out these hot toys, guys. We've got the Luke and Stormtrooper disguise. We've got a Boba Fett, the Holiday Boba Fett, which is Sideshow exclusive. Tons of Stormtroopers. This Leia rules. We've got the Mando and Grogu. I mean, come on. It starts and stops with Darth Vader. Like, if you're looking for a, a hot toy Star Wars collection, no we better place the to start. the down there. Yeah, like, it's awesome. Then we have the new Thanos. Iron Patriot, Thanos... Uh, Thor. We have a Joker from Suicide Man Squad too. just kind of hanging out over here. Like Ryan's like, we have that? No, I mean, so this is awesome. the Goonies uh, key. I have one of those in my own office. I will, uh, I'll show you that right now. That's pretty cool. We also have the Mondo Motu stuff, guys. So it's there really is funny. the key to the Goonies right there. Can I be honest with you? One of my favorite pieces that you have is this Simpsons piece. Check this out. This is awesome, guys. So that is called Nuclear Family, and that's uh, made out of wood. So uh, that's so rad. So there's a uh, lots of artwork. Yeah. And then here this right is a uh, part of my uh, Skeletor I ordered over Check a year out. and a half ago. He's got a headache. Being, <laughs> I think we got the other part of the staff in the back. So uh, so cool, man. Once that's built, that's going to be something to come and check out. But, uh, yep. Graded room time? Uh, we gotta make it quick. We got, like, five minutes. Cool. Well, guys, we've got some cool Schlake stuff and all kinds of, like, old-school vintage toy items. We've got some. You cool know, whenever the celebrities come in and sign, they always pick up these Lottie dolls. So these is, are, like, uh... Also, did I see a Space Trooper Hot Toys on the bottom shelf? Possibly. Space Trooper bottom shelf. Is that the We've got all right? kinds of troopers. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Tons of reaction too, guys. Ren and Stimpy. But going back to these cases. Oh yeah, we also got lots of shack attacks. Uh, this is a this. So, so, so there's awesome there's more Star Trek stuff down there, someone was asking. So like I said, we have fully restocked the store. And uh, lots more stuff. And I am currently photographing a whole rack. I just added, uh, I think Dina and I just added like 300 items to the website. Uh, these Dino Riders for, there should be more than one in there, but there's the- Captain Planet too. You don't see that stuff. There's a T-Rex. So basically you're just gonna have to come in here. We got some, uh, uh oh, Slimer dropped his chips. I'll just- Oh man, come on Slimer. There we go. <laughs> so we got some uh, old school Hot Wheels. From the 80s i think that rack was uh maybe some new stuff oh yeah some more batman stuff there just came in and uh like i said the grade room is looking a little bare but that just means people are buying a lot of stuff we have over 400 items uh, being graded so I can't wait for those to come back and we can fill up all these cases. We still have a flag. With the box. With the box. I mean, that's awesome. <laughs> Go bots, guys. I, I mean, we, that's awesome too. Like, Someone needs to get that uh, Jurassic Park command. Yeah, I agree. Like I said. So uh, yeah, we just shipped out a few more graded figures today. I just I like to show this room off when it's full and when it's in this kind of shape, just to show people that these these are definitely sought after items. Oh, Chewbacca! Come and on. keep in mind that we do buy, sell, <sighs> and trade, especially like today, guys. We are looking to buy a lot of items, or if you have one of these graded pieces on your hit list, 
keep in mind, we do trade for these. And you'll need to buy a Chewbacca. I have one of those in my collection. That is a red Chewbacca, for sure. Uh, we got that Falcon in uh, last Sunday, maybe? We so got the Terradrome in with the box. So we got the Han and Carbonites. I mean, there's tons of heavy hooded. So like I said, I can't wait to get our... Then we got like maybe 50 vintage carded figures and we have tons of G.I. Joe carded stuff being graded right now. And uh, we saw the Batman skateboards. And there was something else that was put. Omnibot, Omnibot, rip, dip, de doop. I can't believe no one's bought that. That <laughs> box is I, huge. I that is to. the size of a mini fridge. I have a friend who legitimately wants it, but I want it too. <laughs> she wrote Princess of Power, guys, web store. All these items, guys, can be found online at DallasVintageToys.com. And uh, like I said, we are serious buyers. Scott and I are going out of town tomorrow with a U-Haul. We are leaving at like 730 for a four-hour road trip. So, yeah, they'll be buying today. We will be trading tomorrow. We would we'll... love to buy so much stuff today. Uh oh, the vacuum's acting up. And we have <laughs> so many loose figures being graded as well. And you can buy that R2D2 by Sideshow. No big deal, right, guys? So, yeah, we're going to be open today from 11 to 6. Please follow us by the Slimer on Facebook and Instagram. You guys know the jam. We're going to be putting all kinds of cool stuff up today. There's Dina. Dina's going to turn on the lights, make this thing fully operational. <laughs> fully operational. And we got a wide variety of helmets, too. So, uh, I mean, there's just so there much stuff that uh, if you all have. Uh, so we still have some uh, third party uh, Transformers. If you have any boxed modern Star Wars Transformers in the box, loose Transformers, uh, boxed or carded G.I. Joe's, modern or vintage, uh, any NECA items loose or in the box. Ninja I mean, Turtle stuff. Ninja Turtles, any 70s and 80s action <laughs> figures. We definitely want to buy that today or trade towards it. Doesn't matter. Right. So uh, definitely come in. We're open 11 to 6. Today we're buying only. Tomorrow, just only trade. So. Hope to see y'all in one minute.